Hello everyone, this is Mimi from Mimi's Crafty Shop. Welcome to my channel. I have got a video share that I want to um, show y'all and I uh, have finished up with my project for Miss Doreen Rook uh, from Ooh La La Vintage Treasures. I have been on the Crystals and Pearls Kit Club and I was a guest design team um, project member for the last three months. And this is actually the last thing that I that I have done. So I wanted to do a quick share on it and show y'all how beautiful this turned out. And uh, I just really loved it. And this was actually the Angel Whisper kit. Um, she's started new kits and I'm excited to say that I'm gonna continue to get her kits. And I absolutely love them. Um, this right here turned out really pretty, but I wanted to show y'all. I did do this. I will link this um, below. I have a video on um, a tutorial on doing it and also a video video share on it. Um, this was a little file folder that um, I think Jennifer, that is our design, her design team uh, member, did. And then um, Doreen added all the loveliness to everything. Um, and come up with some other things that she designed. So let me get started on this. This is actually a folder that she had sent with the kit. Um, I'm not for sure exactly what it's made out of. I don't know if it's card stock, uh, card um, poster board. Um, I, it's kind of thicker, uh, might be even a file folder. So um, it's really, really pretty. And I wanted to show y'all um, this little charm here that she sent with the kit and it is just gorgeous i love it it's so pretty i, I added these little um jane austen um berries on there i thought they were really pretty and then this little bling thing that you can put on um it has like a it's like a buckle um that's really pretty that was mine um, this right here is the fabric that she had sent. It's kind of a white, um, shiny, shimmery fabric. And then this uh, this fabric right here that's kind of a pink meshy. Um, this is something I had in my stash, some um, rosy ribbon. And um, let me open it up and I'll show you the um, really pretty applique that I, I put on there. This is an applique that I had in my stash. So, um, added that thought it was just gorgeous on there and it just really was pretty so i wanted to add that to it um this is actually stamperia i added a few of that because of the wings on the little girl and then also there's wings on the unicorns too i'm not for sure the name of that but um, i'm sure most of y'all know what it is um anyway so let's get started this opens up like i said dorian had already made this folder okay i added the pink um on the spine because I did sew this, uh, I folded all this up and sewed this inside. Or, no, I didn't. I actually um, hand sewed it, um, remember now. And I also um, sewed on this uh, white fabric, which turned out really pretty. This is, she sent several of these in the kit. They were so gorgeous. Um, all this pretty embellishments and and stuff another one of those wing charms um, little pearl drops on this little book clip here and um, I love the way it looked together so I just left that on there here is um, a little pocket that I put on the front um, this is actually a window envelope that she sent with the project and it was already folded over so I made like a pocket and sewed it down and this fabric here she sent with the kit very beautiful soft um feels like a really washed um cotton and remind me of a vintage you know cotton back in the day and it may be very well be vintage i don't know i loved it though and i'm i actually photocopied it because i wanted uh something a little stiffer so i cut out those roses and put on here and here is um she gave me this right here which had these beautiful laces on there so i just made like a little flip um have some dyed papers in there and they were lace dyed so i just uh, sewed that on there and just made a little booklet out of it this was something i had in my stash it says victorian angel which is the theme that i went with on this particular journal this is something she sent here with this little blingy sequence and um 
let's see, um, this right here is a, um, is the fabric, and I put one of the doilies that she had on there and, and made a copy of it because I, I wanted something to put in this, and um, I thought it was just beautiful. It just shows um, who Doreen is and, and how beautiful her kits are. She has the most prettiest doilies I've ever seen. <clears throat> I made a little pocket here, and all this stuff in here, most of the papers and stuff are Doreen stuff, okay? She sent, has sent me in the past with other kits. I get so much stuff, and you know, I don't use all of it with each kit, so I have stuff left over. These are actually some little cards that, um, ephemera that she sent with the kit. Aren't they beautiful? And then I just love this. Here's that little unicorn um, and little angel wings um, stamperia that I had in my stash. And it went so well with this, so I had to use it. And then also, that stuff that she sent, all those little pieces of laces and stuff, and that little heart. Oh, it's so cute. And look at this little angel here. I put stickles on her, and she's adorable. And Doreen, I don't know if she realized this. Um, let me turn this off. I don't want like gold. Something coming on, off of there. Um, she sent this music paper, and it's called Baby Face. But um, his other big hits include Margie, which I don't know if Doreen read this or even she seen it, but um, my name is actually Margie, and I go by Mimi on my YouTube channel because that's what my grandkids call me, and my um, store is called Mimi's Crafty Shop. And I just love this, Doreen. It's just, that was just so neat whenever I seen that on there. So there's that beautiful mu music paper. This is some kind of English, uh, very vintage paper that she sent. And I put some uh, washi tape on the spine. Here is some more music paper that they uh, avocado dyed up. Um, here's another little applique that she sent with um, this beautiful uh, doily, like I said, and just some more lace. These are some little charms that I had. They're actually um, Christmas ornaments. And um, I, I've got these at a resale shop, so I added some of those to it. And this here is something she made. She does a lot of layering and stuff. She makes up the prettiest things. Um, I just love the way she layers stuff with paper and uh, laces and, you know, it, bits and pieces, a little blingy there. Um, just gorgeous stuff. And it just turned out so pretty. I loved it, so I had to stick it in here. She has sent these um, big wide envelope, envelope, okay, I'm going to get this out in a minute, windowed envelopes, um, and so I added those um, to this. Here is a beautiful Jane Austen again, and I took and put this um, wing on her. This was a stamp and a die cut that I had purchased. And this is more stuff that she had sent me in the past. And a little, little tuck spot I made with um, her little ephemera card. And this is from the Sweet Indulgence Kit. That's from my stash. This right here is a really cute picture. I just couldn't resist. It's from my stash. Um, this was a little circle she sent me. I just folded it over and stapled it on there and used it as a tuck spot. And this is a real pretty picture I had. This is a coin envelope that she sent. I loved it, and I love that washi tape. I just love that sparkly washi tape. And that came from um, Graphic Fairy. Uh, here is a little message thing that she sent me. It's called Important Message. And I think that all messages are important, especially if they came from angels, all right? Not that I know that angels talk to you, but anyway, I just thought that was a cute idea. It's just my little fun thing. Anyway, she sent me this um, vintage paper here a while back. It's from a, a book. And then here's a smaller window envelope that she sent. And this is part of stuff that she makes. And here's some more little bling that she, um, lace and stuff I, I made into a little rosette. See that? I had this, um, and I cut it out and put some uh, stickles on there. And I wanted to show you, because um, I did sew this thing in here. I put these on this, the little um, thread here, and that's actually a little angel, a little gold angel on a little pink, um, button. Some ledger paper. 
Here is a little postcard pocket. Um, and this is a little picture of an angel that I had tea dyed. And then I made this little booklet up here. And this was from my stash. And it's the little angel really on the front. And then I just did some stamping on inside. Just some different papers I had. And that turned out really cute too. Okay, here is, this is a little glassine envelope that came with the kit. I just put this little layering on there, a little stamped um, ephemera, and I actually added a tea dyed um, paper that I had, and I had did some script, script writing on there to make it look like a little letter in there that you received from somebody. Did some stenciling here. Little... Um, tag I had in my stash and put some, um, what do you call this? Oh my gosh. Seam binding ribbon. Couldn't think of the name of it all of a sudden. Little angel I put on there. This came from the Graphic Fairy. This is some more of Doreen's beautiful doilies and then that's a little angel that I cut out. Have the picture there. They're pretty. Did a little layering here. Another one of those little Christmas ornaments. And then here is um, I did um, embossing on this on this pink. I thought went pretty with the kit. And Doreen actually made this right here, which is a part of what she does. She does all these really neat little things. Um, and I just added this stuff in here in the pockets. Just some little things that I had, and then this was something that she sent. That's a little angel picture. I like that sticking out. And then here's a little lace pocket she did up. Isn't that cute? Look at those little angels. Love that lace pocket. Oh, that's a great idea. More little cute things that I had, and little hearts. This is part of the stuff she sent. I love this little stuff that she sends because you can do so much with it when you're doing your crafts. Little angel there, um, real pretty um, music clip that I had. Or another little angel there. Some pink pearls up and on the side. And this right here, it just, just I just love stuff like this. This is, she sent me this real pretty pink um, gauzy material. And then I had this picture and I put little stickles on there. And she sends a whole bunch of this um, sequence, little pearl, pearls and beads and stuff. And also had these little things in here. I'm not real sure what they are, but um, you can use them to, you know, stick down on things. Well, I when I seen it, I said, mm, angel wings. So I actually put that on there and um, it looks like a little angel wing. Didn't that turn out cute? And then this is just something I fussy cut out. I thought that little girl was so cute. And I made this out of one of those hair clips. And this is more of her beautiful um, doily stuff that she sends and uh, appliques and stuff that you, you can cut up. I wanted to show you something. I, don't, I might have already put it up. Well, I guess I did. I wanted to show you something that she sent me that I made a lot of my wings out of. Okay, this right here is just a little tag I had. And this is all the stuff that she sent me. And I'm putting it up here on the top. And this is really cute. I'll get up here and let you see it. I made that up and these little rosettes I had in my stash. And then this little Jane Austen, she has little wings on her. And then here's another one of those little envelopes. And... Doreen sent this right here, too. It's so pretty, and I don't know if you can see the sequence on it, but I love it. And then I made this little um, booklet up that went in here. And here's another one of those trading cards. And um, I had bought um, some little vellum wings um, from, I think it was Tim Holtz put them out. And these are just so cute, and I cut it apart. It's actually uh, was stuck together, and I just took it and cut it apart and acted like she had little wings on her. Isn't that cute? And then I made this little journal up to write in. These are so much fun to make, and just using some of the stuff that Doreen sent. And Doreen, um, she's 
she does a, a really fantastic job on her kits. Um, this is a little fussy cutting I did on this little lady here, and then this is some appliques that she sent. And when I seen that, I thought, oh, that'll be cute fairy wings. So that's what I did on that one. Here is a card I made using a new embossing folder I had with a cutout. And I love this little girl, and she had a little bit of um, yellow on her, and I thought that looked good with that blue. And then I added that little um, butterfly wing on there to her, isn't she pretty? I love yellow. More writing space, another one of those um, angel wings, stickles. And then here is a beautiful applique that um, it's got little pearls on there, sequence. Uh, Dorian had sent this a while back and I'd kind of been savoring it and not using it and I decided to put it in here. What I liked about it is this actually comes off. Um, it had this little ring on like, um, I don't know what she where she gets this stuff from, but I'm sure you can buy it. It's like stuff that sticks, but it doesn't really stick. And um, it, it can, so this can be taken off, okay? Um, I really like that and I like to know where she got some of that because it's a great idea. To use that when you're when you're making stuff you don't really want it to stick down permanently and I can't I have no idea what it's called and here I made this big old lady here with angel wings that I cut them out put some stickles on her she all nice and glowy and then this is the other side of that big pocket and then here again I, um, Jane Austen with some peachy color butterfly wings, and then I made up this really cute with a little rosette. And I love this picture right here. It's one of my favorite. Love that little girl. More of her beautiful paper and little stamped camera. Baby face. And here's another one of those cards I did up. And I thought this one turned out really pretty. And then here's a little thing that inside you can write on right there. Um, this is Stamperie, I think. And here is um, that fabric again. And then I glued this real pretty heart on there that's got the little angels on there. And then some more Doreen stuff. Uh, Doreen actually made this part of it. She put this uh, music paper down in this really, really pretty um, um, scrapbook paper here that has that crown on there. She has the most neatest scrapbook stuff. And this is part of her um, applique that she sent. Isn't it beautiful? I've been savoring that one too. So um, finally used it. It was hard for me, but I did. Um, then I had this collage set up. Um, I had this little pink. Um, it's kind of a, a velvet, I mean felt um, dually. And then this applique, um, I'm not for sure if I got that from her or not. And then this little angel, which she's, it's adorable, isn't that cute? My mom gave that to me, I think. And so I finally, I have a couple of them and, you know, I finally used it and um, I thought it was so pretty because it kind of peeks through there and you can see her. So anyway, here is this beautiful um, journal I made up. And then here is another one that I just finished doing. Um, this is one that I took and, um, you know, I've never made a journal like this before because I've never taken and um, punched the holes out and then just did the tie method. But I decided on this one I was going to, and um, this is here in embossing. Um, and then I had this little girl and I stickled her up. And then this is some more laces of Doreen's. And um, this right here is really cute. And this, Doreen gave me this idea. She, um, had did a heart on her, I think this is, her kit that's coming up and she had taken all this beautiful stuff that she gives us and she had glued on that heart and when I seen that I thought I'm going to give that a try so Doreen looky here you inspired me to do that and that's just some tea dye I did up on that paper and I did this little pocket here Got some little cute stuff tucked in there and more little paper some of this paper I had from my own stash that's really pretty. I love that lady right there, that little fairy. Doreen stuff. This little small ephemera, um, I mean, glassing bag she made up. I just loved it. It's so cute. 
and then this little tag she had sent, and then I made that other tag, and then some more little stuff that she sent. I made that flower. I mean, I had that flower, though. Some more music paper, some stuff from my stash. And then here's the other side. This is an envelope. And I put a little lace on there, and then here's a little tag I made up and did some sewing on there. It's got that little cute girl on there, and I just thought this was a cute tag. I think somebody gifted this to me. I'm not for sure. And then she sent this, too. I love it. Isn't that pretty? Here is a circle that she had sent me, and then here's more of her little ephemera. And then that came from her uh, Sweet Indulgence Kit. And then I made another little pocket here, and this is the little angel thing that she sent. And then I made this tag up, and this right here is actually a napkin she sent a while back, and I did this waxing technique on there, which I have a video up on that, so um, y'all need to check that out. I learned a new technique for me. It might not be for some people, but um, I was real pleased with the way it um, turned out. A little angel wing on there. A little heart. This is part of um, that little lace scrap it paper she sent and had a little extra piece of it, and so I just stuck that in there, made a little corner side pocket. And then here's another little pocket I did on the end with some more angels from the Graphic Fairy, and then this is just a little postcard. And then on the back side has this little angel that I stickled. So anyway, um, this is this is it. I finished up my my stuff for Miss Doreen and I'm excited to um, be getting my new stuff from her. Um, I'm going to continue to stick with her um, Crystals and Pearls Kit Club, so we're going to be getting a new kit here anytime soon, and I'm excited to um, get it, and um, I just want to thank Doreen for allowing me to go on this little journey with her, and I've had such a great time, and she's such a sweet lady, so y'all check her out. I know a lot of y'all are friends with her on Facebook and everything, and um, are in her kit club, and um, she's just, like I said, I can't say enough nice things about her. All right, well, y'all have a blessed day, and thank y'all so much for watching.